the way, we're we're in Scott Valley. I guess this is going to be actually the first video. So uh, let's see. Uh, I think he just pulled up, maybe. Well, you guys are probably wondering why he says first video. That's not for me. That's for him. So he's had some problems on some of the other videos he recorded with me, which sadly he doesn't get to release for you guys. But he fixed his issue. It was with OBS. So this is his first video. So just wanted to let you all know. And let's continue on with the RP here in Scott Valley Roleplay. Said he wanted to talk about something important. Not sure what it is, but we're about to find out, I guess. Hey, what's going on, man? Hey, yeah, what's up? Uh... I don't think I want to talk right now. There, there's a cop. There's a cop out there. Yeah, I don't want him hearing what I gotta say. Oh, we can go in the back or the bathroom. Yeah, let's walk in the back. I believe that's Atos. Now let's walk all the way. Yeah, I was about to say that just gives him a reason to suspicion. Ah, right, well, no, they gotta, they gotta figure it out. I don't want him just to spawn there. And listen to us. What you want to talk about, man? Yeah, so like, uh, there's this, there's, there's, there's some guy that still works at a bar because when I bought the bar, he, he came with the contract, but he was still working there. He's been, I think he's the one that's making us like go under, and I think we're losing business. I was even told by the cops. You're talking about that foreign guy? Yeah, he's got his ball or whatever. I think he's got like a pink shirt on or something. I don't know, but yeah, I, yeah, I, I know who it is. Apparently, uh, he was selling a uh, like. Uh, water to a cop that was spiked and was trying to get my business shut down apparently from what I was told from the grapevines apparently he's upset that I bought the bar from the old owner because I guess the old owner let him do like a lot of chillax relaxed things and I'm not like that man you gotta you gotta come to work and do your job that's what earlier when you were BSing around I mean I was talking to some other local that came I clocked you out I, I understand I didn't share that that's, that's why I threw you that money that that we got earlier. Yeah, and, and then once you threw it, I clogged you back in because, I mean, that really helped us out, man. But, yeah. Um, Are you going to fire the guy? Or, I mean, or? I mean, I want to fire. Oh, hold on, I'm getting a message. Oh, it's the guy. He says he's going to work soon. Yeah, yeah, but no, uh, I mean, I, he doesn't want to, like, quit. I think he's trying to get fired. Uh, and I think he's trying to get workers' comp. I think he's trying to get hurt, too, in the job. Uh, I gotcha. <laughs> Oh. Oh, what? what? Mm -hmm. Yo, what's going on? Oh. What's going, going on, on guys? Hey, uh, you guys are. We got a we got a call saying that you guys are just taking beer and you guys aren't supposed to be here. You guys are banned from the bar. Oh, I, I didn't know I was Becky banned. Call again on us, man. No, it's I'm Deborah. Tired of this. Uh, Becky, Deborah, Matt, Brad, I don't give a shit. It's, these fucking people are something else, man. I mean, if I'm not allowed here, I'll leave. Yeah, look, man, they, they're saying that they want you out of their bar. Uh, I don't know if they want to trespass you or anything, but they're saying that you're just taking beer and you're not even paying. No, nah, I so. paid for my beers. I threw five dollars on the gr uh, on the table and she said she didn't want my fucking money. I'm all, I, I, only, said, I only had one yeah, beer. I just took a beer. Uh, well, I if you guys... If you guys want to go just hang out here, I'll go talk to her really quick and see what's going on, alright? Alright. Alright, give me one second. I, I think he's going the wrong way. I realize that. What we should do is walk out the back, walk to the front, when that door shuts all the way. Yep. We're not leaving, we're just going to walk to the front. Like, where'd you guys go? I'm not gonna run either, I'm just gonna walk. Like I wanted to smoke, we can't smoke in the bar. Mmm, smoke. He followed me.
Yeah, shit, fuck. I was trying to tell Dickie about what, and there, there were cops. What was going on, man? What's going on? Hold on. Just I had to smoke a cigarette. I don't want to smoke inside and burn your face down, you know? I get you. What's going on? Yeah, they want us trespass. Yeah, that's messed up, man. I pay for my beers. It's whatever. Yeah. I'm tired of this shit. My bar's better anyways. Yeah. So, did you guys come in one car, or... No. Two different cars. I, I came in my bug, right. man. Alright, Mickey, are you good to... How many beers have you had? Are you good to drive? I've only had one beer, man, and I didn't get to finish all, right. all the way because the glass broke and she didn't want to give me no more. So I probably right. got like a quarter of it gone. Alright, yeah, she just... She wants to both of you guys trespass. I just, I just need you guys to get off the property. Mickey, I'm pretty sure you want a bar. If you want, you can just go hang out there instead. Yeah, I'm gonna go to my bar. I got free beer there. I don't gotta pay like I gotta do here. Yeah. Uh... I don't know what you're gonna do today, Dickie, but I'll see you later, man. Alright, man. Meet me at Coachella. Uh, I can't get in my car? Fuck the cops. Yeah, I know, man. Hey, meet me at Coachella. I gotta, I gotta finish talking to you. Alright, man. Yeah, so, sorry about that bullshit, this fucking cops. It's whatever, man. Shit happens. Yeah, but as I was saying, yeah, I think the guy's trying to catch, like, insurance fraud, and I think he's trying to get, like, pay without working. I, I think he's the one causing this, so he's clocking in today. He texted me and said he's on his way to work. I hate to ask you to do this, but i done it twice to two of the bartenders that worked there. I think the one girl name was Becky. I forget who the other person's name was, but... Yeah, they died, and I went to jail for that and whatnot, but I don't want you to go to jail. I, I, I'm sorry that I had to ask you to do something like this, but, I mean, I tried asking Ricky the other day, well, yesterday, before he went to jail, and he tried telling me that he'll do all this other fucking bullshit, but he won't do that. What do you need done, man? Well, what I need done is he's going to go to work. You're going to go clock in with him. You're going to be working with them. You're going to tell them who you are. Like, I, I'm, the, like, I'm, like, the best friend of the owner. And you're just going to work with them. And eventually, like, you're just going to, like, RP that, like, you got to take out the trash, you know, type deal. And then like, the same dumpster where I put those bodies and where I've hidden before, you've hidden before from the camp. It's just, he's going to happen to, he's, he's going to take a, he's going to take a nice long nap, if you know what I'm saying. I got you. I, I know what you're talking about. And then if we get, if we get rid of him, then we can't get an insurance scam. We can't get like him trying to get free money. We can't get none of that bullshit. I gotcha. See, so I'm just trying to yep. protect the bar. I mean, you don't have to do this. It's only if you want to help protect the business. And that I think he's gonna make us go under. And all that money from Mona and fucking Mickey Jr. that we put to try to get this bar up and running gonna be like basically a waste of time. Sounds good to me. Yeah, man. All right. When did you clock in? Uh, well, I think you're gonna have to go open her up because you got keys to my bar. So like, basically, oh, right. you're gonna go open her up, and then he he should uh be there pretty soon. All right. Yeah, I'll go. I'll start heading there now. Yeah, sounds good. All right, for sure, bud. All right, have a good one. Be All safe. Right, be safe. Right, let's get out of here. Yeah, I can't wait for him to finish the job. I'll get a call later and he'll say that he's done it. Can't wait. Yeah, shit. I gotta go pull up at this bar. Hopefully everything's doing alright, you know. The last time I was there, the cop with the spiked water and whatnot, you know. I mean, that wasn't me. I, I tried getting out of it, you know, but... Yeah, we're just gonna have to see what's gonna happen, you know. I, mean, I know I'm a little late. Having car troubles, I had to borrow my wife's new car. Yeah, 
we'll just see how things go, you know. I'm about to pull up here to the bar. We're talking about sprinklers. There's no sprinklers in here. RP that there is. Yeah. Heck, and all the bars out here in fucking the sandy area, even the city, there's no fucking sprinklers, so. Nah, they can't fucking do that shit just because the MLO doesn't have it. Nah. Marshals. Oh hey man, what's going yeah. on, man? Oh, what's going on? Hey, I'm just, I'm just gonna clock in. Oh, are you? Uh, which uh, I can't think of your name. My, uh, my name. Uh, I mean, do you need to know it? Kind of. Yeah. I mean, I, I I'm Dicky. I'm the manager here. Uh, yeah, Mickey's the owner. Uh, my name's Steve David, man. Steve, I got you. Yeah, go ahead and clock in, man. Hey, man. I wonder what's going on here today. Why are the cops here and shit in the fire department? Uh, you do need to have those, so that's the only thing that we have for you. I got gotcha. you. Uh, did you have any questions at all? Uh, no, sir. All right, fantastic. Um, we'll go ahead and email you a copy of the fire inspection report, and then uh, we will uh, come back in a couple weeks, and uh, we'll check for the presence of those uh, lights. All right. Sounds good, man. All right. Sounds good. Stay safe, guys. Alright, thank you, you guys too. So, so, what, what happened, uh, Mr., uh, what'd you say your name again? Dicky. Uh, Dick. Mr. Cheese. Yeah, d okay, yeah, Mr. Cheese, uh, what, what was those fire department guys doing here? Uh, annual fire inspection, safety hazard, stuff oh. like that. Did, did we fail? Uh, no, technically no. The only thing that we don't have is a sprinkler system, which, I mean, I'm, I'm surprised that we don't have one. And then exit signs, which is common. So, uh, well, I guess uh, some of the money I'll have to go into some renovations for sprinklers. I mean, shit. And exit signs. I mean, shit. The last guy that apparently bought this bar said he was going to re re reinvent it. Then the last guy that bought it put a motorcycle club here, got rid of the bar. But then some other guy bought the motorcycle club from the guy that put a motorcycle club here. He said he was going to reinvent it, and he literally makes hey, the going? same bar. Yeah. Uh, how's how's it going, man? Hey, you guys got soda in here? Uh, yeah, we do. Hey, uh, can I just get a Coke? A Coke? Yeah, we'll get you an E. Cola. One sec. Thank you. Caught it a Coke. It's an E. Cola. system uh, how much for the coke? there you go uh it's gonna be free you're a cop man all right here's uh 20 to keep that have a good day sorry all right oh, cool. shit. appreciate it well great whoops you, you, you get what i meant yeah that is a nice cop yeah, some are, some aren't. Yeah. This motherfucker just put fucking 20 in his pocket. I could have swore he <laughs> just saw that. <laughs> Alright, let me sign into the register so I can clock in for my uh, cash register shift.
Oops. Dishes. Fucking guy, did he just take fucking ten dollars? I got a hundred dollars. Motherfucker! <laughs> I swear, I just saw him fucking pocket that shit. I don't know, I'm gonna have to tell Mickey. Where's my phone at? Hey, I'm gonna go clean the bathrooms real quick, man. Guy, it is. Took twenty out of the tip jar. Yeah, and take from the register. Oh shit! Yep, I heard that. And text. There you go. Make you flowers. And yeah, just text Mickey. This motherfucker. I'm gonna bag up the garbage for him. Just get done cleaning up this bathroom. Ready? Yeah. Let's Come on, motherfucker. Just get out here. Throw this in the dumpster. Alright. Let's open up that. that. Oh, that, damn. Dad, that, that's why I said fist. Yep, yeah, I know you can go back in. Oh shit. Fucking die, motherfucker. Fucking die. God damn you. Fucking die. I'll break your fucking. Many unbearable hours later. Go ahead and open it. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, that's gross. What the oh, fuck? Oh shit! Uh, hey, no, 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 no. You are not free to leave. Stay right here. <laughs> now don't forget we got CCTV cameras here now. Meanwhile. 
Holy shit, let's head back to my bar. What the fuck's going on over there? I heard a cops are called. Better fucking hurry, because uh, everybody's about to pack up and leave. Oh, I'm about to turn left and be down the street, so. What the fuck? <laughs> what? What the hell? <laughs> Just pull into the bar. Holy shit, there's a lot of people here. Oh, yep, they're taking me to the station. Holy shit, there's a lot of people here. My bar is popping tonight. Fuck. Shit, come on, guys. The beers are all inside, not outside. Oh, not, not legit. Not legit. Not legit. What's going on, man? I've got a few questions for you, okay? Hey, what's going on? First off, can you face away from me? Ha! <laughs> I'm getting fucking cops. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Fucking it's horn is going detained, off okay? like it's steady. You um, questioning? Bro, I'm okay. in cuffs. Uh, I'm in cuffs. Mr. Mickey was an accomplice. He knew about what was going on, and I'm an accomplice. Told you told him I'm an accomplice. Oh, motherfucker! Right. We'll transport him to the station. I ain't an accomplice. Oh my god, dude, this horn will not go yes. off. Yep. I don't know why. Yes. Your horn's going fucking bonkers outside. Oh well, we're talking in a minute. Um, who can I put in my car? With? Unmarked uh, Explorer. I'll fix the horn. Usually at night, though. Oh, I'm, I, I'm yeah, I'll, I get it. Yeah. I get the horn. Hey, someone um, plug Jesus his battery. Jesus Christ, Longhorn. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, that, I can't. I, yeah, well, you, you, you should have you should just say that you did it already. Fuck that. I was gone. Clear enough. Yep. That cop said that you told him that. Nah, that's bullshit. Uh, can you lock everything up? Hey man, am I free to leave now? Yes, sir. Okay, have a good day, officer. Hey, you need to tell those bikers yeah, exactly to get up and grab him. Was. I was like, Mickey wanted me to start the bar today because he was going to do running around. I was like, he's not going to be here until after probably we close. And then he was going to enjoy his day off. And he said, well, what happened? He was like, does Mickey know anything about this? I said, no. I said, the only thing Mickey knows is he wanted me to watch that guy because he thinks he was stealing from him. And then, you know, because he was going to try and take an, uh, take an insurance scam or, like, let's do it, steal money from him or hurt himself or whatever and claim shit. Yes. And I, I told I told him all that, and he was like, uh-huh. Yes. He was like, but, but, so Mickey's in on it. And I was like, no, I didn't say that. Yeah, basically when I walked in, he told me to turn around. I said, what's going on? He put me in cuffs. He said, at this moment of time, you're going to be under investigation. And I said, why? What for? He Probably because you pulled up and you're the bar owner. No, he had told me his exact words was that he was told by you that uh, I, I told you to do something. And then you did it. And now I'm being it. But he didn't tell me what. He just said, I told you to do something. And then you and then whatever you did, you did. And now I'm being investigated. I was trying to RP like I didn't know. That's, that's why I say if they look at your phone, you should say, nah, messages are all deleted. Right. Cause that nah, cause that's kind of that's kind of BS in a sense. Because nah, they you just can't say that just because yeah, you, I was texting you, and then the guy gets transported to the hospital, whatever or wherever they fucking take a dead body, and I show back up. Like you just can't assume that it was me. And he basically said you had said he had said my brother basically you had said that I, that I was in him with it, whatever it was. But he didn't tell me what Hang it on. was. Hang on. Six. Yeah, time for M23 here. What's going on, hey, man? Ricky. I'm not going to jail, am I? At this time, you're just being detained for questioning. 
All right, yeah, I was just out running errands for my bar, and then I come back, and there's lots of cops, and I walk back in, and apparently Dickie's arrested, and now I'm being arrested, or under arrest. I don't know. I'm just just gonna tell you to be quiet right now, okay? All right, man. Is there anything on you that's gonna poke me, sick me, hurt me anyway? No, all I got is my car keys and my wallet, man. Okay. I was just out doing deliveries. Okay. I was told not to drive semi trucks anymore, so I was driving my bar van, man. And is there anything we can get you? Water, coffee, soda? Yeah, I'll take a I'll take a water. Okay. Alright, hang tight in here. Alright, man. Alright, here's that water for you. Ah, uh, thanks, man. So, tell me your account of, actually, before we do that, I need to read you your Miranda rights, okay? Alrighty. So, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to have an attorney present for any question. Uh, if you do choose to decline the right to have an attorney present, at any time you are welcome you to ask uh, book that right and we'll have either an attorney um, court appointed to you or uh, you can hire your own attorney. Did you have any questions about your rights I have read to you? Nah, man. I'm, I, I'm good. I understand them. Okay. And do you wish to have a lawyer present for your questioning today? Yeah, nah, I mean, I don't think I should need one. I mean, I don't know okay. what I did. Fantastic. I'll have you sign this sheet of paper that's uh, on the table right in front of you just stating that you... Uh, Understand your rights and are waiving the right to an attorney at this time. Alrighty, yep, yep, there you go. Fantastic. Alright. So, why don't you... Why don't you tell me uh, about the events that you witnessed today? I mean, I didn't witness anything until I got back to the bar. I mean, after we got stopped by you in that truck, we delivered my food... And then I went and got my bar van out because, well, you told me I'm not allowed to be driving that truck anymore. Apparently my stuff's revoked or taken away for some reason. I went to try to go get it fixed out, but apparently they said I was in Georgia selling, like, drugs in the back of... And I did do that, like, a couple years ago, and apparently they revoked it, so I can't never get it back. But I was driving my van around, and then I was like, because I'm not getting back in the semi-truck because I'm not trying to go to jail, so then... I I was gonna I was gonna clock in later. I told Dicky I was like I'm gonna take most of the day off and I'm going to like restock on some of the stuff because well obviously our trailer got stolen in the truck so we lost a lot of our food that we had in the back there so I had to go restock and we lost money for the bar. I came back and supposedly there was a new guy that we had working there that I guess when I bought the bar he was still employed there so he still had a job and then Dicky was working there and I was gonna come back and I was gonna meet the new guy and then I was gonna come back there's cops and this motherfucker. I don't know what's going on man. Okay. Fucking swag. Just give me a couple minutes here. Um, Is he trying to be your lawyer? No. Right Look at the skybox. All right. I was talking to Isaac. That's why. Right. Let's see. Um, let's see. I Fiddles don't. with garage door at 296. Oh, yeah, because he's pissed. A T slash T. Kicks in back door at 296, robs and steals bear and money. Wow. Yep, he, he's pissed and salty because I didn't want to do bar review with him. You should do like a T slash 911, the bar alarm goes off. Because you got all the shit for the system and all that. You were clocked in, I wasn't. So I don't have nothing. Yeah, they're saying I'm an accomplice. That I texted you and you said okay. That's what I was told. That's fucking bullshit. Fuck.
What's going on, man? Yeah, I've been read my rights. I did a 911 on the, uh, bar alarm. on the CAD. A bar alarm? What, what bar alarm? Your, your bar. I did a 911 on the, uh, bar alarm. on the CAD. A bar alarm? What, what bar alarm? Your, your bar. What, what do you mean my bar? It's being robbed? Yeah, uh, Isaac, I mean, Williams just ran out. He walked in. He's like, Mickey, what's going on today? I was like, going good. He's like, have you been read your rights? I said, yeah. He's like, bar alarm. I'm like, bar alarm? What are you talking about? He's like, your bar alarm. I'm like, what are you talking about? He's like, it's being robbed. All right, sorry. What's going on, man? I feel like I ate Taco Bell, but uh, I definitely did not eat Taco Bell. Uh, yeah, that sounds pretty fire right now. Do you got any? Um... I don't. Ah, damn. I, I I can see if we can get some here. Oh, yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, just don't give any to my brother because I think he's snitching on me. Okay. And I didn't do anything, man. So, are you aware of what happened at the bar? I just came back. I thought y'all were there to have a party and get some food and get some colas and whatnot. And the other civilians that ain't a cop and ain't on duty get some beers. I thought my bar was about to be popping for the first time ever with all those customers. And then I walk in and then all of a sudden I'm being put under arrest. And then I'm like, what's going on? I, I was out running my errands today to restock my bar back up. So we got a call about a uh, foul smell coming from your dumpster. Uh, After opening it up, um, we found a body. Ah, uh, man, that, that's got to be the third body this year. Because, there, I mean, I killed the first two, and I went to jail for that already. But I don't know who would have killed this third person. I mean, I don't even know who the new guy was, apparently. All I know is Dickie was on the clock and some new guy. I think his name was Steve. I, I think it might have been the new guy that is no longer with us. Oh. The, who killed him? Well, it was it was Dicky. Ah, uh, come on, man! No, he, he didn't do that, did he? We we have, we have video of him coming up behind the guy with a pipe wrench, I believe it was, and smoking him. Ah, uh, that's messed up. I mean, I don't know why he would have done that. Um, I don't believe we have any charges for you. Um, do you have any idea as to why he would have done it? I mean, no. I mean, I don't even know the guy, so I couldn't really tell you because I don't know him from Adams but I mean obviously that guy maybe did something while they're on shift I, I have no idea man this is I, I'm, I'm kind of shocked hearing that Dickie would have killed someone because he told me that the days of being a criminal are kind of over after I opened the bar because he wants to be more legit but now he's out there killing people yeah alright well um, at this time you are free to go so I mean I appreciate it. I mean, how am I going to get back to the bar? Can someone give me a ride? We're pretty far. I, I can give you a ride once we uh, finish up with Dickie, if that works for you. Yeah, that's fine. I, I can go sit outside and smoke. Okay, that works. Yeah, you just have to show me the door. I've never really been here before. Yep. Ah, uh, I'm getting scot-free. Good. Good. Because that was bullshit. They, you'd never told them. They, I was literally told. You told them that I was an accomplice. Just hang nope. a left through the uh, emergency exit right there. Hey, right, man. Yep, I'm getting free. Isaac said that they got nothing on me. That's good. And I was sitting there. My brother killed someone. I, I don't know why he would have done that. He said that as soon as I opened his bar, he wants to be legit and not be a criminal as much anymore. I mean, that's my stuff. He's like... Hey, come on, Isaac. Uh-huh. <laughs> there we go. All right, well, I'm about to steal this car, and I'm going to try to make it back to the bar. And it's a good car, too, because it's Sultan that I'm stealing. I wonder if they caught them, uh, the outlaws. Well, when you make it back to the bar, it'll probably be all looking broken in and shit. I'm on my way, I'm on my way back now. 
Right. Put my seatbelt on. I mean, I, as soon as I broke the window, I hit enter for the 911 call. So, if there's any cops there, they're probably going to where that the ping location went off at. Ooh. Don't flip. Don't flip. Oh. Oh. I just got to make it back to my bar. I'm passing the Indiana bar right now. Oh, shit. And a cop was crossing an intersection. I almost fucking hit him. Oh, we're, we're gonna turn right in Sandy. Ah, oh, shit. I gotta get rid of this fucking car, man. It's fucking hot. Mm. I just heard struts when I drove by this cop uh, situation. Shit, I'm gonna park this car in fucking Mona's old garage. Alright. Back. Oof. Let the garage shut. Let the garage shut. Yep. Yeah. I'm walking back into my bar. Oh shit. Fuck my bar, man. It's fucking destroyed, man. What the fuck? The windows are fucking busted. Oh, all my beer is missing. Oh, and the register's even broken. Up. Uh, let me go check to see what the back looks like. Hopefully, they didn't break it to my house. Ah, uh, fuck, man. I don't think it was broken, actually. No, it was only the bar. But I'm gonna RP it out. Ah, uh, shit. Now my my door looks like it's intact up there. I'm gonna just go check to make sure you know. Nope, my door is still fine. No, no, it's not broken into. Still locked. Fuck my bar. And I'm gonna have to figure out when Dicky gets out of jail because I think that's where they took him. I'm not sure. They didn't tell me where he was going, but yeah. Fuck. Well, until next time, ladies and gentlemen. I'm back at the bar. I don't know where Dickie's at. I'm kind of worried. I think they got him. They found the evidence. I mean, I, sh I should have told them. I should have texted him and said, Yeah, man, just, uh, just say that with the cameras don't work. But then again, I don't want him to lie and get tramped up with more charges because the cameras do work. But yeah, hopefully he's all right, man. Other than that, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching. Uh, I did tell Dickie to do what he had to do, but allegedly that one cop had said that I was a part of it and that my brother told no, no, no. At that point in time, like yeah, I did tell him to do it, but you can't just allegedly say that I'm an accomplice because you have no proof and you'd never check his text messages and. He said something about he was told and sent about a phone and nah that nah that didn't make any sense because when I asked my brother to snitch he said no I wasn't gonna RP anything because I think the cop was just doing that trying to fucking get me to snitch and say I did it fuck that I ain't, I ain't fucking snitching on my brother I mean yeah he did it I, I didn't know what he did allegedly but yeah so other than that ladies and gentlemen we got rid of that guy for this bar now it's just Mickey and Dickie's bar heck we may have to get rid of Ricky next man. I think he's a cop. <laughs> I, th I, I think he's a cop. But other than that, ladies and gentlemen, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Go follow my brother, Goddammit Danny, over there. And I'll link his shit down below. Other than that, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. As I said, and follow us because if you are a Firefly and you're subscribed to me, you will help us light the way and keep the light shining on here at Firefly Gaming. Uh-huh. <laughs>